That's all a man can hope for during his lifetime, to set an example, and when he is dead, to be an inspiration for history. The American flag has not been planted on foreign soil to acquire more territory but for humanity's sake. The liberty to make our laws does not give us the freedom nor the license to break our laws. Strong hearts and helpful hands are needed, and, fortunately, we have them in every part of our beloved country. War should never be entered upon until every agency of peace has failed. The path of progress is seldom smooth. New things are often found hard to do. Our fathers found them so. We find them so. But are we not made better for the effort and scarifice? Our faith teaches that there is no safer reliance than upon the God of our fathers who has so singularly favored the American people in every national trial and who will not forsake us so long as we obey his commandments and walk humbly in his footsteps. I do not prize the word cheap. It is not a word of inspiration. It is the badge of poverty, the signal of distress. Cheap merchandise means cheap men and cheap men mean a cheap country. Half-heartedness never won a battle. The more profoundly we study this wonderful book, and the more closely we observe its divine precepts, the better citizens we will become and the higher will be our destiny as a nation.